down here last night down this road and went to the uh, Sportsman's Inn I think it is, there it is the Sportsman's Inn where I had fish and chips and a couple of shipyard beers and then I walked back at least to see the views. The road to this campsite is uh, like a dead end really. I don't think it goes anywhere. Uh, just to the campsite and the pub and maybe a couple of houses. On our way to Winnett's Pass on the Sheffield Road and the views and the, the scenery is great. Sun's out. Working our way up to onto the tops. Everyone out for a little ramble. Russia Paul off to the right. Cracking views. Blue John Cavern, whatever that is. Sounds like it's probably a shop. So we're only a couple of minutes off of Winnet's Pass now. We've got to take a, a, a left here. So this is Winnet's Pass. Come on, hurry up, hurry up. Right. So this is Winnet's Pass, people. Look at that, you, that is absolutely spectacular. We're not going to stop, we're just going to have a drive through. Absolutely fantastic. It's well worth the visit to come and see this.
lots of people walking this. What a brilliant place to come to. We will just pull in, I think. Stop, don't miss the incredible underground journey that's supposed to be by boat. Wow. That looks fantastic. Right, let's carry on. Super duper. hills beautiful they haven't really got a route on my phone probably because there's no internet but the navigation says straight on 0.3 of a mile Castleton, welcome to Castleton. Yeah. Straight over it says. Full said. It's going to be busy in here. Oh, and well, I've got a roof back. Beautiful little place. A village shop. We're not interested just yet. We're going to get out of here and have dinner somewhere else. Stores. The Peak Hotel. All the buildings built out of stone as opposed to brick.
is the youth hostel at Loose Hill Hall. On the A6187, the Castleton. Well, we've just gone through Castleton. It's obviously an old mine, just over on our right, that building look. Or well, maybe it isn't, Quarry Works or something, Quarry Works probably. Marshes, that's the name of that lane, and this is Hope, and it's 30 mile an hour and 200 yards, which is fine by me. There you are, Hope. It's the A4016 which leads to the A57 and uh, we're going to go alongside a uh, lock or late lock we're not in Scotland are we? silly old me it must be a reservoir or a lake look if you look at the sat nav you can see there and uh, my next waypoint is there so that'll be that'll probably be um, the Snake Road start off and I think we hang a, a right at the Snake Road but we'll we'll get past this first this is the uh, Yorkshire Bridge Yorkshire Bridge in we might just pull in if there's a pull in spot just have a look at the water Unless we can see it from the road, it's fenced off by the look of it. Look at that! There she goes. Quick glimpse of it through the edge. There's a viaduct down there as well, I can see. You might not be able to see it, but there's a viaduct crossing there. Get a glimpse. Stay there, boy. Oh! Looks a bit choppy out there, really. It looks like we're going to go along and over that viaduct, so I'll take you with me. We're going to go over this Viaducty Bridge, some lads on their bikes. Put such a high wall on it you can't enjoy the view.
A57 to Manchester. Look at that. Cool. So this is the Snake Road that we're on now. The start of the Snake Road. Yeah. So over the bridge or the viaduct. Snake Road, technically, on Snake Road, look at that. Woo. There you go, look. Twisty Snake Pass. And we're going to ride it steady, and if anyone wants to ride it fast, they're going to have to overtake me. I won't ride it at snail's pace, but I'm certainly not riding it fast. 50's fast enough. Brilliant views. Absolutely brilliant. Spectacular. Alongside this uh, water. Fantastic. I'll look up the name of this... Uh, when I edit this, I'll look up the name of the water and uh, put that on there. It's, it's going to be a reservoir, um, but they haven't, uh, the sat nav hasn't told me the name of it. Police enforcement cameras, 50. Well, we're only going to do 45, 50. Well, I must admit, it was worth coming just for that. Didn't have such a good day yesterday. It's a bit lousy, but uh, today, pretty good. So we're on the A628. And we've been past a sign telling us that we're in now in the county of Barnsley. So I'm hoping to avoid the wet. We got a little bit of rain on the windscreen, uh, but we're just staying in front of it all. It shouldn't be wet as we get further up, I hope. And uh, this this road's taking us over the tops reasonably windy it's not too bad blue skies ahead a little bit of rain here and there it's all okay. here